Kai Ninja News, or CNN for short, with your host, Kai Ninja. Welcome back to Kai Ninja News, or CNN for short, with your host, Kai Ninja. And yes, I have merch. Anyway, in the news. Folks, I just told you. I warned you, and you ignored it. COVID's on the prowl. And now even President Trump. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Even President Trump. Are you kidding me? Okay, let me make something queer. And I'm going to make sure that you queerly say this. I am eight. I'm not going to go there and talk politics. So chillax. And that's halfway wax and chillax and chill. Okay? But I'm going to talk about COVID. I wish President Trump... And everyone who is sick, a speedy recovery. But I have to say, come on, for the love of God, wear a mask. Don't hold public events. Social distance. And for the God's sake, wash your hands. For the love of God. You know what you need, Mr. President? My mom, oh yeah, she will like snatch away your iPad, eat, make you eat a ton of veggies like a walk like a million, and make you do like a lot of chores like a million again, until you follow the rules and understand that you have a responsibility to be a good example. That is what she does to me when I don't listen. I mean, hey! And I know better, my goodness. Okay, anyway, according to my mom, Danbury City Council was going back and forth on whether to rename it sewer plan after John Oliver. The mayor is all about it, as long as John Oliver shows up and donates. Most council members are good with it because they see this has been an opportunity for Danbury. But some council members were no way, Jose. And quite frankly, these guys need to watch some Caillou Ninja to loosen it up a bit. But not too much. Trust me, you'll get crazy. It's not a monument. It's where a poop goes. To report on this situation, I've tapped into CNN's Senior City Council Commentator, I made that one up, Councilman Farley Santos and his daughter Chloe to give us a lowdown. Hey Caillou, Councilman Farley Santos here with my daughter Chloe, and we're here to talk to you about the John Oliver Memorial Sewer Plant. We need to get this thing named after him because it's exactly what he deserves. He badmouthed us on national TV. Yes, it went did. all over the world. So you know what? We need to make sure that we name this after this guy. It's exactly what he deserves. Now, we talked about it at our city council meeting the other night. Some city council members had a problem with it. I honestly don't get it. The people are for it. Our constituents are writing to us and letting us know that they want this thing named after this guy. So you know what? We're going to get it done. And we also have a message for the other city council members. Right, Chloe? What's our message? Don't British this up. Don't do it. Back to you, Caillou. Back to you. Thank you, Councilman Santos and Chloe. Breaking news. Danbury City Council voted in favor to rename his sewer plant after John Oliver. Great work, Mayor Belton. Council and shout out to Danbury's High Priestess. Taylor! Okay, so, in other news, Stepping Stones Museum for Children in Our Rock, Connecticut is hosting the first ever virtual OKC 2020 Kids Convention in October 17 and 18 for children and families across Connecticut and beyond. Attendees will also enjoy connecting with an impressive lineup of youth leaders, including Project I Am founder Jack Hill Johnson, CT Kid Governor Mirwell Stainfield, and guess who else? Yes, this guy, Caillou from Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short. To register or to see additional events details, please visit steppingstonesmuseum.org slash KC2020. That's it for today's show. 
everyone, don't forget to hit up my channel on YouTube to help me reach a thousand subscribers on www.youtube slash duckrom slash c slash kai ninja. Have a great weekend. Please remember to stay safe, wear a mask, and don't even ask. Rap, rap. Go.